Hundreds of people have died since Hamas's extraordinary attack inside Israel. What are the origins of this conflict and why has Hamas attacked now? The Jewish people regard this land, the land of Israel, as their eternal homeland, saying that they, their faith uh, and their culture was born here over 5,000 years ago. Palestinian people believe that once uh, Jews were expelled from this land, it was their land that they lived in. A philosophy for the Jewish people called Zionism was created, which was to find the Jewish people who they feel had been expelled from their eternal homeland here to create a homeland for the Jewish people. Of course, with the uh, Holocaust and the murder of six million Jews, that accelerated the need and the desire for the creation of the State of Israel. That happened in 1948, but those people already living here, the Palestinian people, described that event as Al-Nakba, the catastrophe, when the creation of the State of Israel meant that hundreds of villages with Palestinians left into exile either in Gaza or what is known today as the West Bank. During the uh, late 80s and early 90s, particularly in Gaza, there came an Islamist movement, which is what Hamas is. It stands for Harakat Muqawama Islamiyah, which is the Islamic resistance movement. And it became quite a formidable force. Um, what has really made Hamas, though, a real singular threat militarily has been the support that the, the current leadership of Hamas receives from Iran. In the last few years, there's been what they call the war between the wars. It has not been anywhere near the conflict that you're seeing today. This is the first time Israel has declared war uh, on an enemy since 1973. That has completely transformed things.